Spack, 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 in Daddy's kitchen. Well, look, you look here. Hi, people. Hi. <laughs> we have got a sweet honey in the kitchen today. Hello. Hello, mother. How Hello. are you? Hello. You look so beautiful. Look at that smile. Look at ah, your hair. Ah, so thank you. <laughs> And these two are decked out in their Jamaican attire. Like, tell me you're a Jamaican without telling me you're Jamaican, okay? Yes. <laughs> look yeah. at them, look at them, look at them, oh. dressed up and nice. But we're in the kitchen today because you guys already know what it is. You know, when mommy is in the kitchen, that means that there is something that has to be made that daddy may not be the top notch at, but she has a down pat. Look at, look at him, look at him, look at him. <laughs> So, uh, you know, without ooh. further ado, Mommy and Daddy, please tell the people them where we are met today. Sweet potato pudding. Jamaican style. Yes. <laughs> Lord of mercy. Yes. Yeah. <laughs> so we are making sweet potato pudding, Jamaican sweet potato pudding. This is something that you guys have been asking for for a very long time. It's actually one of my favorite Jamaican desserts. And would you consider it a dessert? I think so. Yes. Well, you yes. can't, but we eat it anytime. Anytime, yeah. right? So, you know, it's uh, there's a particular, you know, sometimes you have a, a pudding and it's just not it, but mommy is going to help you get to the one that is the authentic, amazing kind. All right. So let's get into it. It's already a minute and 40 seconds into this video. Mommy, where do we start? We're going to start over here. Over here. So daddy is going to show you what he has grated, he's grated the potato, sweet the potato, sweet potato, the yam, yam, and he's gonna show you how he grates it. Oh. And like the type the of potato that we use. We use the we use the purplish, the purplish looking kind of potato like this. Okay. okay. And when you peel it off, it's like white okay. under there. And the type of yam, I don't think the yam matters, but this yam was what what kind of yam you said this was? It was afu yam. Afu yam. This was afu yam. White okay. afu yam. White afu yam. Okay. Yeah. yeah. So he's going to grate the rest of the potato and show that to you. All right. That is sure, Swagwan. You love rum, bro. <laughs> <laughs> okay. So, and some people, some people would have blend, would blend it. But when you grate, grate the potato and the yam, you get a better texture in the pudding. Okay. So hence why we're going way back to use the grater. Not that we don't have a blender, we do, but um, it's it comes out nicer when you grate, grate it, it. Okay. Yeah, from scratch. So remind me again what's inside this container. So Daddy, you're grating sweet, 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 sweet potato. potato. Jamaican and sweet potato. Jamaican sweet potato. And, and so Jamaican what's already yam. in here? Afu yam. Af, afu yam. Yeah. Okay, so yeah. Yam. And we're using the yam for the consistency so that it holds better together. Okay. Okay? Because there will be flour in this pudding, but it, there won't be a lot of flour. Okay. Okay? So, so we, we have put the yam, they've combined the yam and the and the sweet potato so that it holds together. The consistency. Okay. Less flour, more yam. People, you got to be strong. Mm-hmm. So great at this thing. Daddy's an expert on the greater end. Yeah, man. Yes, I, yeah. used, I used to this. Old fashioned way. Old fashioned way, the good way. Yeah. yeah. And you build your muscle at the same time. Boy, look on the muscle them. Look on the muscle them. <laughs> on the muscle oh, them. Mercy. <laughs> Uh, why is it that I'm going to sell some of this muscle? <laughs> <laughs> okay. I can. Okay. <laughs> Funny guy. Okay. Finish? Okay. So this is like your container of yam and mm. sweet potato yes. shredded. Yeah. Okay. Oh, it's not shredded. It's sorry. Grated. 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 Sorry. So, no. <laughs> sorry, sorry, sorry. I'm going to honey. So wait, what from. was the little white stuff in there? This is the yam. That's oh, the yam. That's the yam. That's the yam. See? The yam come out more watery than the potato. Okay. All right. 
So I am we, gonna we, hand I this think, over I to mom. We, I think we need one of those big graders from back home. You know, mm -hmm. that really grade this, this stuff properly. Okay, okay. so what's uh, next, mom? All right, so the next thing that I will be combining here, I have half cup of flour, okay? So this is, I'm gonna be pouring the flour. I'm gonna be sifting it a bit there. Sifting it? Yeah. So I'll put that in into this mix. Okay, then I'll put in a quarter pound of raisins and I have the golden raisins. Okay. Okay, so I'll put that in there. I'll now put a teaspoon of baking powder. Baking powder. Just a teaspoon, eh? Yeah. One teaspoon of baking powder. I would never think that something yeah. small like that would make such a difference. So now I'm gonna stir this up. Just combine all the this the dry ingredients together. Just mix it up. The yam, the raisins, the potato, and the baking powder. Yam, raisins, potato, and baking powder. powder. And flour. And flour, that's, all combined. That's all yes, that's in here That's right all now, that's yes. in here right now. Okay. Okay, so we're now over here. We have the coconut and daddy is gonna blend all the coconut. Okay, so hopefully we'll get at least five cups of coconut um, juice from this. Okay. okay, so we're blending. Yeah, all right. So for you to blend the coconut, you got to cut it up. Okay. Small. All right. Okay, put it in. Add some water to it. the right amount just to cover the coconut and you blend So how do you know it's finished See, blending? Small, okay. very fine. Okay. Yeah. And you're gonna squeeze all the juice out. Strain out this. You're gonna leave some of this coconut trash for the for the mixture. Okay. Okay. All right. So you just keep a little bowl on the side. Right. This is what they call coconut trash, you guys. They're gonna use some for the mixture, just like Daddy said. All right. So, mommy, mm -hmm. what's going on yeah. on this side? So now we're coming over here, and we're gonna put all the other ingredients that I have here. Okay, so I have the brown sugar. Okay. okay, so I'm gonna add that to this container here. Okay. Okay. I have some half teaspoon of nutmeg. There. I have a, t a half teaspoon of mixed spice. Mixed spice. Mixed spice. This right here, y'all. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Another half a teaspoon of cinnamon, ground cinnamon. 
I have the vanilla, which is two teaspoon of vanilla, Benjamin's vanilla. Benjamin. Okay. I have a quarter cup of sherry. A quarter cup of white Ray and Nephew white rum. Ray and Nephew. Half teaspoon of salt. And this is all going in one mixture, right? Yes. And here we go. Some butter. One and ounce. I say about an ounce of butter. I'll just mix that out in there. Okay, I got the baking powder already in the, in the other. Yeah, and then I'm going to put a half tin, a half tin of evaporated milk in this. And then I'm just going to mix it, mix it in. All together. All together. Okay. So I'll just pour it in. I'm sort of estimating when I get to half here. Okay, guesstimating. A good Jamaican guess. <laughs> and then we're just gonna stir everything, just stir it all, stir it all, blend it all together. Okay. I think that should be half. Okay. Okay, and then I'm just gonna stir that in. Around. Just to stir the sugar and everything, all the spices together, the rum, the sherry, all of that. Here we are. We're going to be adding the coconut milk. See how beautiful, look how good it looks. It looks so rich. Okay, so I'm, I'll be adding like five cups of coconut milk. So this is four cups and there's one more cup over here. And this okay. is uh, just based off of the amount that we're making. Though, right? Yeah. Yeah. So that's four cups. One more cup. And one added. more cup I'm going to add. There. Okay. okay. So that's all the coconut milk. Okay. In this mixture here. Mm. And then I'm just, just, just going to stir it around. Also going to put a little bit of the coconut trash into this mix here. Oh, okay. Okay. Just estimate to, to how much you would like. Maybe say two to three tablespoon of it. Mm -hmm. Yeah. I love coconut, so yeah. Okay. So now I will be pouring this mixture into that mixture now okay okay, okay. Right. do you want to stir with me yeah so i'll pour the liquid into this that is so funny okay keep mixing keep mixing yeah little darling <laughs> keep mixing Okay. If you guys, I don't know, if you're someone who already knows what pudding tastes like, God, then you know what we're waiting for. See, not, no, yes. yeah, if you everything. don't know, God, you're in for something, man. So you just stir that around, make sure it's all mixed in properly. Thank you. <laughs> yeah. Go over. Mommy said, let me do this. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you notice we did we didn't have to use a lot of flour. Mm -hmm. So, so if you're the, some, yeah, so if you're someone who doesn't want to eat too much flour or can't eat too much flour, this is definitely the type of recipe that could work for you, right? Mm -hmm. And mommy, you're 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 one of those people. So. Yeah. Okay, I'm just gonna tip a little 
just just a little little drop on my hand to see if we need to add anything else no mm -hmm. maybe a little bit more vanilla maybe a little bit more sherry and rum oh well, you know you can't <laughs> go wrong with a little bit more sherry and rum Woo. with a little bit more sherry in it and a little bit of rum and a little, little bit, bit of more rum. rum in there yeah there kick it up a notch mm -hmm. and the vanilla. vanilla there okay yeah. and i'll put a little bit more nutmeg in it you know our 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 mix them you know how we stay yeah as somebody says we pour until the ancestors say, stop <laughs> <laughs> yes, that is the line. That yeah, keep on hearing over and over again. Mm, yeah, that smells mm. so good, no? It's yeah, not, it's not good before, but I know, like, once you start, and that's the great thing about these things is like you kind of have to like taste, just like how mommy did, just taste it and see where you mm -hmm. want to add a little bit more, you know. Whoa, it's a guan, it's a guan, it's a guan. Sure, All of <laughs> it's a guan. <laughs> I tell you, mmm, mmm. So well. Ooh, to taste if it you could enough. smell this so and well. taste it, mmm. Whoa. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yeah, man. Yep, just right. And on a right on target. I know, I know someone's gonna be like, they lick their fingers. They're in their house. <laughs> <laughs> them in a them all. Uh, I tell you, mm -mm. a few we house. Yeah, a few we, we, can, we can do what we want. <laughs> okay, so I have the tin here. I already buttered and floured the tin. I think this tin is a little bit bigger, but I checked all my other tins, and it's like there were little holes in it. So I didn't. Yeah, you know, this is a, a borrow. This is a borrowed one. Okay, so um, I think this is ten inch, but I really wanted nine inch, but. We're just gonna use what we have. Mm -hmm. Okay? The Jamaican right. way. Use yeah. Where you have. Use what you have. Okay, so I'm just gonna pour it in here. It's the teamwork for me. Mm -hmm. This is gonna be so good. I just uh, I okay, just and I'm just shaking it to make sure get rid of any ear bubbles or anything like that, and just you know even it out properly. Oh, the pan looks like it's it fits the amount. Yeah, I feel like this is a perfect, yeah. perfect yeah. pan size. And if we're gonna do the custard on the top, mm -hmm. then we'll have the space for it. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yeah, let's not even start talking about Miss the say, this. Time. Miss say, if we don't need to try this. Boy, <laughs> this is a one. Okay, so we have um, heated the oven to 350 degrees. Okay. Okay, and this pudding is going to go in for at least an hour to an hour and a half. Okay. Okay, so when the middle is firm and it, the when you poke it with a knife and it comes out dry, it should be done. Okay? okay, and then afterwards, then we'll do the custard. Okay. Show you how to do the custard. Because there is okay? a glaze. There is a glaze that goes yeah. on top yeah. of these. When things. I was growing up, they has they called the pudding hella top, hella bad, bottom, and hallelujah in the middle. Okay, <laughs> all right. So we will see if we can try to do the custard and on put top. it on top. Yeah, yeah. Okay? In my opinion, that's the only way yeah. to have it. All right. Into the oven, yes. she goes. Okay, and now it's 5 01, so we'll give it by six o'clock. We should can probably check it and then say um, 6 30. Hopefully, it will be done by then. All right, okay, let's All right. do it. Mm -hmm. Okay, people, so the pudding has been in the oven 
I think because it's a little bit bigger. Oh yeah. My God. So it's been in the oven for about two hours and maybe quarter. Okay, so I'm just gonna stick my knife in it to see what's up with it. I think that's good. Okay. I think that's good. Oh, yeah, 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 mommy. Maybe you should go into that apartment that doesn't have a hole. Okay, okay. there. There. Yeah, it's good. 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 Okay. good. So no, people, we are gonna make the custard for put pan top of it. <laughs> Whoa, cause we can't wait for it to it, you know, we can't wait for eat it, so I'm going to show you how to make the custard. Funny. Okay, so okay. I'm going to leave that there for now, okay? So here we are, these are the ingredients for the custard, okay? Mm -hmm. So I have the vanilla, which is two teaspoons of vanilla, okay. okay? I have half a teaspoon of cinnamon. One teaspoon of mixed spice. I have two teaspoons of brown sugar. Quarter teaspoon of ginger, ginger powder. Half teaspoon of melted butter. So see the butter is melted. And a quarter teaspoon of salt. Okay, so I'll put that in there. And now for our coconut milk. Okay, half cup of thickish. Ours is a bit thinner than thickish, but it's okay. So we're gonna mix it all in here. It's half cup of coconut milk, and this is the real coconut milk. Okay, see? All right. Just rest that there. And now I'm just gonna stir that in. Stir it all up. Make sure. I think I'll try to use a one of the little whisk. Yeah, the little whisk here, and just whisk it out. Make sure it comes right. All the cinnamon and everything is all blended, and the sugar grains are all out. So now, what we're going to be doing, what I did, I turned the oven, it was on 350 to bake it. So I've turned the oven now to 375, and then what I'm going to do, I'm going to pour this liquid on top of the pudding, okay? And that's what they call the custard, okay? So I'm going to pour that on top of the pudding, and we're going to give it maybe about, say, 15 minutes. And, and just watch it, okay? And make sure it just, um, I guess, I guess, crystallize upon top. Yeah, caramelize on top, okay? Mm -hmm. This All is right. my favorite part because yeah. anytime I have, uh, you know, pudding, I like the ones that have the glaze on top. So, so mommy was gonna, gonna do it without it, the glaze, but. Pull it out here, okay? And I am gonna just pour it up on top, all over the pudding. Okay, right, and then we're gonna put it back into the oven. Just gonna try to spread it a little bit. Make sure it's spread all over. Mm -hmm. All over. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. Okay, and then put it back 15, 20 minutes to get that nice caramelized color. Okay, and then we're gonna share your plate when it cools a bit. Yes. Okay. All right, <laughs> Lord of mercy, people, look ya, <laughs> Lord of mercy, whoa, okay. look yeah, on mom. the custard, look on the color, I cannot me deal. say, me can't wait for this finish, Ooh. Mm -mm. This I'm taking it out now, woo, 
I'm just gonna rest it here and it let it cool. Amazing. Oh, oh my this is what goodness. I'm talking about. Ooh. Ooh. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. Mm -mm. It looks gorgeous. Oh uh, my goodness. Okay, so what do we have to do now? Okay, so now. We're gonna let it cool for a bit. Like really, some people says to at least cool it for 24 hours or, you know, however, you know, and some people may even rest it in the fridge and let it cool oh, properly. Sweet. But we don't have all of that time because we wanna share your plate. Mm -hmm. So we're gonna let it cool for a bit and then we're gonna cut out piece and show you the thing, man. Lord of mercy. Okay, I can't. I can't. I'm done with you guys now. Lord of mercy. Lord of mercy. <laughs> I gotta go.